What's up, YouTube? Uh, today we have uh, uh, programming uh, used ECU for Mercedes Benz. That's the part number, the old part number. And the new one is right here. So, what you need to read is uh, 5B or SB08. Uh, this one right here, when you take the back cover off from the ECU. So I just want to make a quick video for the location of the Abram and how you read it and uh, what you need to do over. So this 5B08 or SB08, the same one. So this one is the old one and that's the new one. So for anything blue 2006, you can transfer the Abram from the old one to the new one or you can read it and write it or you can fer, uh, like virginize and use your uh, launch uh, through the OBD so the launch can do it through the OBD as long as you virginize or have a new ECM if you do, if you have a used ECM you need to virginize in order to use a launch so next time if we have a chance we can do it by launch but for this time it doesn't take like even five minutes to read it so before I make the video, so I went ahead and I read, I read the old one, and I read the the spare one in case, and then I will go ahead and write write down the old one to the new one. So like this, we don't have to do any extra work, and give it give it back, and you can go ahead and plug it and start the car. So let's go. I uh, you gonna when you open the binary file and read it. You're gonna click read. I use you can use iProg or any any Abram reader. Doesn't matter which one. And also you can use your uh, Lancer if you have a Lancer uh, that comes with it. This piece right here. And you're gonna you're gonna use your your uh, clip connector. Click clip it, and then you can use it in circuit. In case if you have this uh, from Lancer, if you have an iProg like this. You can go ahead and read it uh, with a quick connect that comes with the uh, iBrook. You can break it over. Yeah, plug it over right here. And then you go ahead and read it. That's a binary file. And then if you want to do any modification, let's say that the birth number starts with WD, RF64JX. You can go ahead and modify it as much as you can. If you have another one and you wanna modify the, the VIN number, you can do it right here. And let's say this six, you can do it like five, whatever. So anyway, so let's go back. I just wanna show you, I don't wanna change it because that's the, right, the correct one. So you can go ahead, you can read the VIN number and you have some other option if you wanna do anything else. So once you're done with it, you read it from the old one and just go ahead and click right and you're done. So, and that's it. You can get the cover back up and send it back. You don't have to change the keys. You don't have to program any more keys. So the purpose of the video today is to show you where is the Abram and which one for any, for C-Class Mercedes uh, 2005. 2004 anything below 2006 if you have different uh, one more than 2006 uh, you're gonna see the hardware the hardware version number is 35 or like it's gonna be like 38 something and uh, this one is 35 or two so if you have the the one it comes sometime it doesn't come with this it comes with a Motorola so you're gonna go ahead and choose Motorola from the menu. Okay, so Abram, Abram. So anyway, when you when you read the when you read the SB uh, SB zero eight, it's gonna be under ninety five right here. It's gonna be under ninety five, which is stand for SBI, and you're gonna go ahead and click SBI zero eight. That's for the Abram that we have and that's it you read it and write it 
So in case if you have a different one with Motorola, you're gonna go MCU and then choose Motorola and it's gonna give you the diagram. And next time if I have one for Motorola, I will uh, I will do a quick video. And you're gonna you should have the diagram and uh, read it and then write it back to the new ones. It should be quick and easy, like just maybe not even five minutes job. Okay guys, so see you next video then. Thank you for watching.